Hello children. Now we are learning a physics lab experiment. This experiment is from the lesson Reflection of Light at Curved Surfaces. The aim of this experiment is determine the focal length of a concave mirror by measuring object distance and image distance from the mirror. To conduct this experiment, the material required is a concave mirror of known focal length and a candle a measuring tape and a screen stand to trace the image. Now the procedure of this experiment is place the concave mirror, candle and the measuring tape as shown in the figure. Now what we have to do is by keeping the candle at different lengths from the mirror along the axis and by moving the screen and find the position that where you get the sharp image on the screen. First of all, here the object which is candle is placed at 70 centimeters from the mirror. You can see here the candle is placed at 70 centimeters. Now we have to trace the corresponding image on the screen. By adjusting the screen back and forth, we can capture the image on the screen and see the image size, whether it is bigger or smaller than the object and measure the distance where we got the image. Here in this case, the image is formed at nearly about 10.8 centimeters. Now note down the values in the given tableau form. Object distance is 70 centimeters. Image distance is 10.8 centimeters. And the focal length from the formula we can calculate here it is as 9.3 centimeters. Now move the object little forward and keep nearly at 60 centimeters. See here the object is placed at 60 centimeters. Now again we have to find the image by adjusting the screen back and forth until we get a sharp image. So notice the value of image distance. Here we get the image distance is about 11.1 .1 centimeters. And note down the values in the given tableau form. Object distance 60 centimeters. Image distance 11.1 .1 centimeter. And the focal length will be 9.5 centimeters from the formula. Now move the object little forward and keep it at 50 centimeter mark. See here the object is placed at 50 centimeter mark. Again trace the image by adjusting the screen back and forth till we get a sharp image on the screen. In this case, we get the image at nearly about 11.7 centimeters. Again note the values in the given tabular form. The object distance 50 centimeters, image distance 11.7 centimeters and the focal length is 9.48 centimeters from the calculation. 
Now place the object little forward that is at 40 cm mark. See here, the object is placed at 40 cm mark. And we have to trace the image on the screen. We need to get a sharp image. For that we have to adjust the screen back and forth. When you get a sharp image on the screen, just stop the there and measure the distance from the mirror. In this case, the image distance is at 13 centimeters. Now note the values in the tabular form. Object distance 40 centimeters, image distance 13 centimeters, and the focal length we'll get is 9.8 centimeters. Now we have to move the object a little forward and keep it at 30 centimeters from the mirror. See here, the object is placed at 30 centimeter mark. Again, we'll repeat the same thing to trace the image. By adjusting the screen back and forth, we'll get the image again. In this case, we got the image nearly at 13.7 centimeters. Now tabulate the values in the given table of form. Object distance 30 cm, image distance 13.7 cm and from the formula the focal length will be 9.4 cm. Now place the object at 20 cm mark. Now again we have to trace the image. See. By adjusting the screen, we'll get an image on the screen. Here in this case, the image is formed at 20 centimeters. By tabulating object distance at 20 centimeter, image distance at 20 centimeters, we'll get the focal length as 10 centimeters. You might have observed that when the object is coming closer and closer, the image size becoming bigger. When it reached to 20 cm, the image also reached 20 cm. In that case, the image is almost equal to the size of the object. Now, place the object at 10 cm. Let us see what happens. Move the screen so that to trace the image. See here, the image becomes such bigger so that it is not captured on the screen. With the help of the table and by finding the average of the focal length, we'll get the focal length of the mirror as 9.5 centimeters. The focal length of the concave mirror here taken is 10 cm and by doing the experiment we found the focal length of the concave mirror as 9.5 cm. Inference By using object distance and image distance, we can calculate focal length of a given mirror. Observation We get different types of images with different nature for different object positions. The conclusion for this activity is the nature of the image formed, size and position of image is dependent on position of the object in front of the mirror.